Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is Ajwa and I hope this video finds you well. If you are new to this place, please consider subscribing. And to all my returning subscribers, thank you so much for your support and welcome back. So I got to know this fragrance by Fragrance World and found out it is duping um, a discontinued Bath & Body Works fragrance known as Mah Mahogany Woods. And when I searched about it, I realized people are selling it for as much as $500. I was like, what is so special about this discontinued Bath & Body Works fragrance that people will be selling it for that high, you know, price? Thankfully, I was able to get this dupe known as Hardwood by Fragrance World. The name is equally intriguing, so I just want to find out if this is indeed going to hit hard as the name implies, Hardwood. So when I checked out the note structure for Hardwood, I realized it's the same as that of... Um, Bath and Body Mahogany Woods, and these include Mahogany, Blood Orange, Red Pepper, Berber Vanilla, Cognac, Sage, Tonka, and Amber, and some Vanilla. So it's the exact same note structure, so clearly it's a deep of it. When you check on Fragrantica, this has been compared to, uh, when you look at, look for the, um, this, what it smells like, it says it smells like just Club by Mise Magella, which fortunately I have in my collection. So I was able to test them side by side to see if they clearly, you know, have some similarities or, you know, like distant cousins. So in this video, I have a sort of analogy between um, Jazz Club and Hardwood. And that is not to say it's a comparison video, but I guess for like the analogy would sort of create the the scenario or how I, or explain better how I see um, Hardwood by Bath by freelance world. Let's think about Jazz Club as this gentleman who is climbing the corporate ladder and has worked for about eight, nine years, has established himself, is well known, you know, makes some money and some decent some money and has also acquired some some taste for better or uh, finer things in life, you know, when it comes to cars, luxury, you know, like um better taste in everything, more refined and most most importantly, very confident. Let's just take this one to be, um, just club to be that gentleman. Then I'll take hardwood and I'll explain this as the intern or that young man who is being, you know, recently hired and is uh, understanding this um, gentleman, just club. So this hardwood is like fairly young or younger, quite new to the working environment, doesn't have much of a taste or preference. So he's understanding um, just club, Mr. Jazz club. So he idolizes and looks up to Jazz Club. That is how I see Hardwood. It wants to be Jazz Club, but it is not. It has some elements which pulls um, Jazz Club, you know, vibes. Because of that aged cognac in oak barrel, it has that. It also has some vanilla, but this one is quite amber heavy. Those are some of the differences. So just take this one as the confidence um man who you know knows what he wants and has the world at his feet and this young man you know being in his shadows and idolizing this gentleman that is how i would describe hardwood hardwood is not like the exact you know um replica of jazz club N nothing i like but it's in the same sort of family it's like this one idolizes jazz club and would love to be him but he's quite young to the game and he needs to get himself um, in order before he can, you know, see himself climbing the ladder as this one is. That is the analogy I have between these two. Hardwood is this amber forward, sweet vanilla fragrance with that touch of boozy oak moss um, vibes to it. It doesn't have oak moss, but it gives me that um, cognac brewed in, you know, or stored in um, oak oak um, tree or oak barrels for it to age it gives me faintly it is not as pronounced as how you get it in jazz club you know and this one too is a smoker but the hardwood is not a smoker so those are some of the differences but hardwood is it's it's very gentle it is not like as loud you know and obnoxious it is not i find it quite um inviting and quite um intimate and i also would consider this as a very unisex fragrance a lot of people have considered um, Jazz Club as more masculine, but I find it very, very unisex. So I'll consider this one equally unisex, you know, although 
people may not agree with me but i find these both um genesis fragrances with this one being like a little more toned down so this um hardwood is like in the shadows of jazz club that is how i find it but very wearable it gives me um a young man vibes whilst this one gives me a very confident accomplished um you know gentleman vibes that is the only difference i don't see this as strictly um evening scent you know i see it as a date night scent but not strictly evening you can wear it for all sort of dates you know especially if you're a gentleman you can wear this one and it's going to you know give you some um some compliments but it's not like super room feeling that is going to pull everybody in and you know unless the person is like an arm's length um, to you then they can really enjoy this fragrance with you it is not screechy scratchy it is like quite well blended very nice one from fragrance world for the price of ten dollars compared to mahogany woods that people are selling for around five hundred dollars because it's discontinued and i understand this one is like a perfect dupe of it i have no idea how that one smells but i understand this one is like a perfect dupe of uh, mahogany woods so the million dollar question here is does hardwood really hit me hard make me want to roll or make me roll my eye to the back and want it more i don't think so it doesn't make me want to leave the one i'm with to start a relationship with this one like this is the, my first love and then probably if this one is not around i'll consider calling hardwood but for the meantime this can be a standing fragrance you know when fragrance um, when this one is not around that is how i'll consider it a lot of people have raved about mahogany wood you know and they really love it that is why they would purchase it at that 500 dollar price point because it's discontinued this one gives you the kicks you know it gives you the kicks but it doesn't really hit me as that hard you know probably the name should have been soft wood then i wouldn't have really expected much from it because with hardwood the, the expectation was this is supposed to hit me hard, but if it were soft wood, then I would, you know, I would have rated it far higher than what I, I consider the name hardwood to be because it's, it's not really, you know, hitting me that hard and making me rolling my eyes for more. Nothing like that, but I still like it, you know, I still like it. I think I will allow hardwood to sit for some time and macerate, you know, so that it can go some more inches and probably hit me harder. That is how I see it for now. But for the meantime and in between time, when Jazz Club is not around, this one is a good substitute, you know, to give me the impression that I'm not missing much, you know. I'm just a bit thirsty today. That is all I have for you on hardwood today. I think I'll just let it sit and then get back to you on the performance to see if it's you know hardened up a bit more so that is all i have for you and i hope you found this video useful please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up i would truly appreciate that thank you so much for your presence here and i hope to see you in my next one take care bye bye